Well, hey guys, uh, welcome to um, Non Sonic. I wanted to share actually an unboxing of the Brio 4K uh, Pro webcam. Uh, this is not going to be a, a super in depth um, overview or anything like that. I'm going to actually do that separately, um, hopefully, after I've actually been using it and then have a little bit more. Um, understanding on how it works and what my thoughts are and stuff like that. This is just basically uh, an overview of what you get in the box, um, quite simply. But <clears throat> actually, the one reason why I decided to do this video, um, I was going to buy this on Amazon, and I did a different kind of a search. I ended up buying this from uh, Grandin Toy, which I believe is only in Canada. I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. There used to be a retailer, Grandin Toy, uh, years ago. And uh, I think right now they're only online, but this was 40 to $50 cheaper than Amazon. Like even with the shipping and everything, like, like net retail price was already $40 cheaper. So, um, you know, quite often if you look at the deals, you know, with Amazon, the shipping, you know, it ends up just working out cheaper and, you know, in the sense that you get a peace of mind that you can just, you know, hopefully, um, easily return it uh, if you got some kind of a problem with the uh, the order from Amazon. Um, yeah, lately, I mean, I've been getting stuff from Amazon and I don't know, you get, <laughs> I had a, um, <clears throat> a binder that I had bought and it was all covered in like greasy finger uh, fingerprints. So that went back and then over the holidays I bought a a mat for like a gaming mat that I that I wanted for some time and it arrived and it wasn't even in the package anymore <laughs> so it's just kind of hit or miss um, anyways you get a bunch of uh, documentation uh, you get this looks like some kind of um, a bag for it well, that's pretty nice you get almost like a liquor bag well, it's got Logitech branding on it Good job, guys. All right. And what is this? <clears throat> USB-C cable. Fantastic. USB-C to USB-3. And then I guess this is like a, a clip of some sort. <clears throat> I'll just check the, yeah, I'll check the instructions afterwards. Uh, the reason why I bought this is the camera that I did have for my channel um, wasn't enough to snuff for any kind of live streaming so that's why I haven't been doing it at all but this is a, a 4k uh, sensor or lens anyway so it should allow me to uh, get a much better uh, resolution for not only um, you know if I want to stream my, my own reactions to games but also any of the other work I might do here I can just uh, live stream uh, reviews and stuff like that so that's one of the reasons why I bought it my old camera was a 720p creative labs camera um, mainly used for like um, the sense technology um, that I've had for a few years now quite, like quite a while so I decided to um, give that to someone else in the family to use for what video conferencing um, and I got this thing which was two hundred and thirty five dollars Canadian so this is going to be a, a really good upgrade so this little clip here actually I could could show you guys what this looks like I'm just gonna pan this up on top of my display there if I decide I want to use it like this it will go there or I'll mount it on the tripod that my phone is actually on right now which I don't have to see how I can possibly do that huh okay well maybe there's a separate mount that I can use to do that feature <clears throat> but anyways I'm gonna oh I see this is a clip remove the old clip and then uh, maybe it's under here <clears throat> I definitely don't want to be messing around with it too much and, and all of a sudden break it on while I'm doing a review here or just kind of a walkthrough. But um, anyways, I'll figure out how to mount it to 
a tripod. Uh, I might actually use this, the phone stand that I'm using for this video uh, just to hold it in place, which I've, I've actually done before. Uh, and it works quite well like that. But actually, I think in that my other camera did have a... Uh, yeah, it actually has it right there in the icon. So I just have to figure out how to, how to get this off. It probably just snaps in place somehow. And... Uh, yeah, there we go. Oh, wonderful. So then, yeah, so this will screw right in the top of the tripod mount. And I just connect it via USB. And I can do all the streaming that I want to do over uh, USB-C. So that's great. Anyways, uh, stay tuned for more of this. Like, you'll probably see it pop up in some video. Um, I'll do a review or, like, a walkthrough of this at another point in time, just in terms of what I, what I think. There's lots of these videos anyways, so, I mean, I don't expect this video to get a lot of uh, praise. But, uh, anyways, I just wanted to update my own channel with the fact that I actually bought one of these to... Um, uh, try to make, make some improvements on what I'm doing. So thanks a lot for uh, checking out this video. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to let me know uh, in the comment section down below. Um, more than happy to answer those, uh, as long as it's relevant to what this is. Okay, anyways, thanks a lot and have a great day.